good morning guys we're on again so today uh, my vlog is about uh, drone and today's episode is I'm going to teach you how to connect the remote control and the aircraft so uh, for me there's two kinds of way how to connect your remote control and your aircraft first I will teach you uh, by using the app so first you're gonna press this uh, button here go to DJI app DJI go so if you see that one so DJI go So go to DJI Go application and if you notice here in my my phone in the in the screen it says uh, it's it's like the camera uh, that's the application side of my phone so you're gonna press the camera So next, go to remote settings. So remote controllers, controller settings. So uh, slide up, and you can see here linking remote controller. So you press this one, and you have 60 seconds to to link it. So the next, the next uh, uh, steps, you're gonna press this button from the aircraft. This button. You just press that one, and that's it. You will you will link it. professional but I think this is really similar to all the Phantom 3 version so I gonna link this by uh, doing manually so first I gonna turn on the remote remote controller press twice the, the second one will be long press and the same thing with the aircraft press twice and the second one will be long press one two so everything is uh, power on now guys so next I will sh I will show you the buttons where you're gonna press it because uh, you need to be uh, pretty quick of this so if you see here C1 and C2 this button here C1 and C2 you're gonna press this at the same time and next is you're gonna press the record, record button and after that you're gonna press this uh, uh, what you call this I think this is a camera or this one you're gonna press it I'm not really sure which part of the controller is this but you need to press this so first this one C1 and C2 next is record button and then this one just press it like that and after that you're gonna see it blink uh, blink here color blue so that means it's now working to to find the aircraft signal then the same time after that you will click this aircraft uh, module uh, signal 
this one guys if you see here there's a rib and the, and the right side will be like there's a hole this, this hole has a switch so you're gonna press it after that uh, remote controller uh, procedure so we're gonna try it but at this moment my my phantom tree is under a fix I'm still waiting for the part of this so I just show you how to connect it manually so as you notice here it's color red the light is color red so I'm gonna try it to press it so C1 C2 then record button then so you see here guys it's blinking so that means it's trying to to find an aircraft signal so after that blink around 50 seconds you're gonna press it here in the aircraft so you got, you're gonna press this one here guys to connect the aircraft and the remote control this side and this color red here it will turn to green that means it's already connected by the remote control so this light will gonna be turned to green so when you press the the remote control manual steps of connecting the aircraft and remote control so you have only 60 seconds 60 seconds to to connect it when the beep is starting and the light from the control will be blinking into blue that means you have 60 seconds starting from from that uh, point then the remote control light as well will be turned to to green so when it, it was a blinking when it is blinking sorry uh, it is blinking by color blue and if you if it is already connected with the aircraft it will also turn to green so this light here is red if you you link it manually it will blink by color blue and it will be turned to color green after that if that's already been connected to the aircraft so that's all for today guys thanks for watching run lager and please subscribe thanks